What is going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Berm and today I'm back. I was gone for like 10 days there. Okay, it was the darkest 10 days of my life. That's not true. I was moving. I was moving to a new space. You see, I'm in a new space. Maybe you can't tell. Maybe you can. I uh, got a couple different elements here. I'm shooting from a different camera. I'm also, uh, I haven't really been able to hear the audio in here besides the little tests that I've done. So I might realize there's better settings for that. Please bear with me while I just try to figure out this situation. Also, the background is bright white. Um, so uh, we, will, we will try to figure out something to make that a little more interesting. I might go green screen. That's not set up yet. I really just wanted to, once I got everything figured out, I wanted to sit down and record a video because it's just been so long. And I'm so excited to get right back into this whole Pokemon YouTuber thing that I was doing. <laughs> uh, and uh, yeah, we're gonna kick things off here with a, uh, a three horse team. There was a pretty there was a pretty popular two horse team going around that had Spectre and Glastrier on it. And I was like, why not make it three? Let's throw a Rabidash on there and pull some Bulldoze Weakness Policy uh, uh, shenanigans. Um, hey, uh, and since this is an original team, if you want to use the rental code for this team, we're going to shoot for 50 likes in this video. If the like goal is uh, set to a certain number and then we hit that number, I then make another video in which I share the rental code for this team. So if you want to use triple horses, okay, three horses, Fire Emblem three horses, uh, horses in the back, I literally put them as the last three slots so that they would be in the back <laughs> because I'm an idiot. Uh, then uh, help this video get to 50 likes, show some love, throw comments, uh, subscribe if you're new, just help the algorithm, uh, help help me help you, help the video reach more people. Uh, and then, uh, you know, better chances that you get the rental code uh, in the next day or two or three or four or 12. Um, also, uh, Look out for a video upcoming um, because I'm going to be releasing memberships for the for the channel quite soon. Uh, they're going to be pretty uh, basic uh, as far as, you know, I'm not going to be, there's not going to be like a $10 tier or anything like that. Um, but there will be little bonus things for people uh, who want to throw, you know, like $2 membership so that they can get some custom emojis, get like, you know, one or two streams a month in which it's just for the members uh, because I'm going to be uh, streaming starting on Thursday nights. I'm going to be doing Thursday night streams. Uh, try to make it a regular thing. We'll see if Thursday works best after we've done a couple of them. Um, but starting this Thursday, which actually I think if you're watching this video, the day it came out will be tomorrow night. Uh, I will be streaming. So look out for that stream. Look out for the video announcing the membership uh, uh, situation uh, because I'm going to sort of break that down uh, a little more in detail. I'm very excited about it. I'm very excited to put in a little more work for people who are willing to, uh, you know, invest a little bit to, to get these channel memberships uh, because I think I have some pretty cool ideas. Um, so I hope you're excited for that. Regardless, uh, I've been talking long enough. <laughs> it's been 10 days and you can tell. Uh, let's jump into our first battle here, shall we? Whoa, that team looks scary and weird. Why is it so spiky? That team is so spiky. Look at all the spikes. Reggie, Reggie Lecky's got some spikes. Whimsicott's got horns. Clefairy's got, Clefable's got spikes. Cartana's got spikes. Arcanine doesn't have spikes, but Zapdos has spikes. That's a spiky team. Tommy, you got a spiky team, buddy. Spiky Tommy. Good old spiky Tommy. I have to, I have to bring, hmm. tough one, tough one. Incineroar is tough to get, or not Incineroar, uh, well, basically Incineroar. Arcanine is tough to get around. If I'm being quite frank. Uh, but if I go in DD and I go Dusclops, then I can uh, set up the old Trick Room to support my Glastrier. And maybe Rabidash can come just to support, because I want to bring Rabidash in, because Rabidash is fun. Because uh, Rabidash does have support capabilities. It's got ally switch. Uh, and also it's not a good Pokemon. So people don't attack it. Meaning it can surprise some folks with the potential. Uh, I don't know. I should, I should not be bringing Rabidash right now. That's for sure. But here we are. I don't want anybody yelling at me telling me, oh, you didn't bring the Pokemon on the thumbnail. I'm bringing them. These two. 
These two? Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna go for an expanding force. I'm not gonna... I don't have to worry about taunt. So I'm really just gonna go for expanding force to get some damage, and I'm gonna go for the old tricked room. If I can get damage on that Arcanine, good. I need to. I need to. Because uh, if Glastrier is going to be my shining, my knight in shining armor, uh, I need that Arcanine as weak as possible. Because I think Glastrier has got everybody else. Ooh, they're Dynamaxing. Oh, it's the beat up strat. It's the beat up strat. I completely forgot about the beat up strat because who uses this duo? This late into a meta, man. I'm, I mean, this is like, this is like Sword and Shield release first weekend. BS, man. Who are you targeting? And can you kill, can you kill Dust Clubs? Probably. Plus four? Plus four? I don't know. I mean, I could have followed me, is the thing. And it makes me sit here. You have to sit here and watch it. It's just, I mean, come on. Yeah, yeah, are you gonna kill me? Does it kill? Plus four. Plus four, ladies and germs. Plus four. Expanding Force does little to nothing. Okay. We do have Rabidash. Now, I could Expanding Force and Ally switch here. Because if they go for the Max Flare into the Ndidi, uh, then I will take it and not take any damage on this turn. I think there's a pretty good shot of that happening. So, I'm going to Ally switch here. Just to try and bring this back. Uh, that'd be sick. Come on, Rabidash, do something here. I brought you for I brought you for no reason at all, really. Tailwind, okay. Max flare. Did I do that? <laughs> Did I do that? Yeah. Yeah, I did. I did. Uh, this gives me the opportunity to attack one more turn with one of these Pokemon. Uh, I think. I think one of these guys is going to get some good damage off here. I got I to gotta target the Arcanine. Is the thing. Um, I think I'm going to... I'm going to... Ba should I bounce into the Arcanine? No, I should wild charge into Arcanine, I guess. Yeah, and we'll just go for one more expanding force. Uh, just see how much damage we can get off on this thing. Zapdos is going to protect. Go ahead, dude. Go ahead. Be my guest. Went for max lightning this time into the Ndidi, uh, which is going to kill Ndidi, even though it's not super effective, but it's going to also power up our wild charge. It's not going to help me kill this uh, Arcanine like I need it to help me kill Arcanine. But that's okay. Uh, and now I really just need them to not call the ally switch. I'm going to ally switch here. Um, I'm going to ally switch and I'm going to Try and attack the Arcanine. If I can't get it, I can't get it. But hey, what do you want from me, here? Got to do what I got to do. Got to got to try. You miss the shot. What is it? You miss the shot that you don't take. So. Thunder misses in the sun. Flare Blitz. Hello? Oh, baby. This game just turned around. <laughs> what 
a call, dude. What a turn. Man, I'm I'm kind of surprised my opponent didn't read that. I mean, I guess they uh, they had to make a call, you know. Okay, so I got it. I mean, if they have heat wave, that stinks. Uh, but I also have two. Uh, I don't know if they stack. I have two flash fire boosts in my mind. Um, so I could double into glass gear. Actually, you know, I'm gonna double into Clefable. I think I am. Well, hmm. No. I'm going to Ice Will Crash into Zapdos, and I'm going to go for the Flare Blitz into the Clefable. Uh, because in the sun, Heat Wave. They did go for the Heat Wave. They powered up my Flash Fire again, unless they unless it doesn't stack. Glass Trier takes it because of Assault Fest. Don't burn me now. Don't you burn me now. Amazing. In the sun, I think it's plus, I think it's like equivalent to a plus three. Because of flash fire. And we get the Icicle Crash. We're sitting at plus one because we killed the uh, the Arcanine. That was the sickest endgame to what was looking like the most outright defeat. I am blown away by being able to pull that back. That is insane. I mean, don't ever give up. Okay. Burmites, don't you ever give up. Because that's... Uh, that's what makes this game so fun. Stuff like that. <laughs> Absolute tomfoolery. Good game to my opponent. All right. I actually, this team is pretty cool looking. Uh, they got a Galarian Zapdos that I really need to give another try. I only made one Galarian Zapdos team and it was back when I had no idea what Galarian Zapdos really was good for. So I should, I should make another Galarian Zapdos video. That'd be good. Um, that's neither here nor there. Neither here nor there. Uh, let's see. I like Cartania in this game. Uh, Dynamax Cartania actually looks pretty okay. But also Glass Gear could be pretty good. Um, maybe we just try to set Trick Room right away. Uh, they do have the Trick Room option with Comfey. So I got to be careful about that. I love seeing the Umbreon too. Wow, how did I not see Umbreon? Also, all female team. Yes, queen. Um, oh, gosh. Okay. Maybe I would get lucky if I went for my just my strat off the bat because Rapidash, I think, is faster than all these Pokemon. So I'm actually going to go for the Spectria Rapidash lead with Glastrier in the back. And I think, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to forgo Kartana. Oh, should I, though? Because I'm not going to forgo Kartana. I'm going to bring Kartana because of the Gastrodon. I don't really know how I beat Gastrodon otherwise. I guess Glastrier is not an awful answer to Gastrodon. It's just not the best, especially if I get burned by something at some point. Um, let's honestly just hope I don't get knocked back by a, by a Moltres because you know they had the Comfey Moltres duo, which is obviously a good duo. Okay, they actually led these two, which I'm not horrified by uh, because I'm pretty sure we can take out that mole trace. I think Rabidash is going to outspeed. So if we just go for Bulldoze right off the right out the freaking gate, Max Lightning into this mole trace, I think we'll be okay. Um, I've been wrong before. Doesn't Umbreon get, does Umbreon get like a, what's that move that's like a priority move that lowers attack? Is it Baby Doll Eyes? Who named that move? A weird person. That's who. Come on, Rabidash. Come on, Black Flames, Rabidash. You love to see it. The flames look purple. They're supposed to be black. They look purple. Whatever. Oh, we have a protect. Well, that's all right. Because we're going to wild charge through this protect. Um, which I think me, oh, you know what though? We just made our Rabidash slower than the Moltres because the Moltres did not get hit by that Bulldoze. So that is a little concerning. Um, some might say a, uh, mistake on my part. <laughs> we did not knock it under half though. So that means actually that they are not going to, um, 
They're not going to get that. Uh, Berserk boost. What is that Umbreon going to do, though? I'm scared. We did pop the weakness policy. Okay. It foul played into my Spectrier, which I'm okay with. I'm okay with. This Spectre is actually not min attack. It's like pretty good attack. It's like it's like one of the lower ones, but it has some IVs and attacks. So that <laughs> that foul play actually did more than it should, and that's my fault. But that's how you know I'm using legitimate Pokemon, I suppose. Um, I could taunt the Umbreon, which I think I'm gonna, because I just don't want it to do anything else. And I could max lightning the Moltres. I'm a little scared of that thing outspeeding me at this point, but if I max airstream it, oh gosh, it's scary. I'm gonna max airstream, I think. What I, th man, would you Dynamax Moltres? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yeah, you might. You might. Ugh. Okay, creepy. Uh, Yeah, at plus two, it will likely be able to kill my Rapidash. Oh boy. We taunted the Umbreon. It's probably going for a foul play this turn anyway. We moved first and we should have gone for wild charge. Oh my God, I can't believe it. Minus one, we still outsped that freaking Moltres. Oh, I'm so mad at myself. I could have killed it if I had gone for max lightning. Please attack Spectreer. Oh my gosh, I'm so mad at myself. I could have killed it. I just was so, I was, I'm so, I'm dumb. I, Airstream would not have been that beneficial. I think I just thought that if they targeted Spectreer with like a max darkness, then Airstream would have given me the plus one to outspeed it on the next turn. I was so sure that I wasn't going to outspeed that Moltres there. And that is, that is just poor uh, trust, faith <laughs> in my Pokemon. And now they are at plus one. Rough. That's rough. Uh, oh boy, that is a bad time. Bad time. Man, Max Lighting, that would have been so hype, too. That would have been hype. But now it won't be. Such is life. We're still outspeeding this Moltres. Wait a minute, is this a min speed Moltres? Is this Moltres supposed to operate under Trick Room? I think it is. That's a min speed Moltres. What's happening in the meta right now? What year is it? Have I been gone for this long? Have I been gone for this long, truly? Wow, 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 wow. What is that, leftovers? I am uh, shocked. Umbreon's still taunted, so all I can go for is foul plays, neither of which, like, I have some good defense on both of these Pokemon, so I'm not totally concerned by that by foul plays. I think it might only have taunt for one more turn though. And can you check that? I'm not totally sure. Why? Why are they min speed? Like, are they literally like quiet Moltres just to surprise people, shock the world? There's a Zapdos. I don't like seeing that at all. Um, Yeah, we have to target that thing. I have to double into it in fact because it can kill everything I hold dear. Is it a min speed Zapdos? <laughs> By chance? Please, please be one. I'm so confused. Man, I should I should have had that Moltres gone last turn and then we would still have a Rabidash up. That's so frustrating. And that's even more frustrating. Why would you protect there? I guess I'm at plus one with, um, I'm at plus one with Kartana. 
Maybe they were scared of that. What I should do now is I need, I think I need to, um, I need to play as if, because Glaster is attacking before Umbreon, isn't it? So, is that, no, it's not. Is it? Is it? Oh, it is because of, uh, because of Bulldoze on turn one. Oh my God. Yeah, we just smoked that Zapdos. Hold on. Cartana gets a beast boost. Yawn. Electric terrain. I don't deserve to win this. So we are slower than Umbreon with, um, with Glastrier. You could have killed Glastrier there. If you just attacked me. They still have one more Pokemon in the back too, don't they? Now they can yawn me unless I kill the Umbreon first, which I might be able to do. With Kartana. There's a Comfey. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is good. Comfey. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Ally switch could be bad. Ally switch foul play into my glass year could be bad. Floral healing. I don't know if that'll save you here. I'm a plus two. I'm a plus two. This is super effective. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve this. There were three turn, like three different times that I should have lost this battle. I doubled into a Pokemon that protected. I used Airstream when I should have used Max Lightning. This shouldn't even be possible. And yet my opponent, like why would, like it, if I'm my opponent, like you, you do not, um, you, you would not, uh, uh, double protect there. Or you would not protect with Zapdos at all. You would go to, you would try to kill somebody. Unless they were, I mean, I guess I did one shot with that Aerial Ace. So maybe they knew that I would one shot with Aerial Ace. They went for Yawn and Electric Train. Man, I got lucky and I am, I am, um, a big enough person, uh, to admit that I still won Nanny Nanny Boo Boo. Stick your head in doo doo. Good game to my opponent. <laughs> okay, game three. Let's see if we can't get one more win here. That'd be sick. Um, this team is freaky. Uh, I don't want to get fooled by the potential beat up strat again. Okay. Uh, there's lots of threats on this team now that I'm looking at it. And my team does not like Intimidate. Um, so there's that. I think, honestly, and it's not exciting, but I think Indeedee Dusclops is maybe the best way to start this. And maybe Rabidash, Glastrier in the back. Now I'm like thinking about that one game where I had the ally switch and in the back and Rabidash was the savior. Though maybe that's not the way to go. It's the way I'm going. It's the way I'm going today. I think so. Oh, I think so. Unless I think Spectre no. Spectre. No, if I can get up a uh, if I can get up Trick Room, then that's amazing. That's truly amazing. So, uh, you know, even though it worked out for us in that first game when they led Whimsicott and what well, that's me wearing tights. Why'd they put me in tights? Oh, my opponent is me wearing tights. Now I know what I would look like. <laughs> Now I know. Now I know. Okay, they didn't leave the Arcanine, so we're not gonna make our choices based on what happened last time. <laughs> My opponent is so funny. Okay. Uh, I'm actually just gonna go for Expanding Force. This is a defensive Indeedy. It does not have Focus Sash. Um, it's, it's a really, it's a set that I have not seen often, but it's a set that works for me constantly. Uh, so that's what we're running on this this Indeedy. We can go for an Expanding Force here, just to get damage off. And I'm going to go for a nice Will-O-Wisp onto this Landorus. Or should I Trick Room? 
No, nope, I'm going to trick room. We got to get it off. Turn one. Come on. Come on now. Tailwind. Go for it. Go for it. Rock slide. We avoid the rock slide with our um, with our dust clop. So it actually is not even going to matter. I'd love it if we didn't get flinched, but we did. That's okay, though. End of the day, that's okay. Uh, let's just go for Expanding Force again. Let's go for a Will-O-Wisp into the Landorus. Uh, if we can just immediately just, you know, cripple that thing. I am not going to complain. Landorus switches out. What's going to take this Will-O-Wisp? Don't be the Arcanine, please. Oh, I'm okay with that. <laughs> that's fine by me. Yeah, I'm cool. We're cool. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> hey, man, it's all good. Uh, clean. <laughs> totally clean. I like to see that actually. Uh, and now let's go for let's double into the whim. Uh, because I am not scared of that metagross at all anymore, and I'd rather not like you know mess around and. Pop weakness policies by. Oh, you know. Going for moves, I shouldn't be getting greedy. We can get rid of the Whimsicott. That means that one more Pokemon has to come out in Trick Room. Their team is not optimized for Trick Room, so we will get to either burn or hit something pretty hard here. Meteor Mash. What are you going to do, man? Come on. Defensive and Deity's like. Defensive and Deity eats Meteor Mashes. For breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And second dinner. Midnight snack. You know what I mean? Okay, we get some intimidates here. Get some intimidates here. Ooh, oh no, intimidates. We're gonna expanding force. By the way, do you like my new Joy-Cons? They're freaking clean. Uh, and we're gonna go for the Night Shade into Arcanine this time, because again, I'm not scared of the Metagross. Protect all you want, sir. What is my opponent doing? Oh, they're double protecting. Okay. But honestly, what's my opponent doing in both their outfit choices and their move selection? Not what I'd have done, that's for sure. And if indeed he's still around, when Dusclops is still around, then, you know, we can still go for the Trick Room Anyway, we still have one more turn of Trick Room, right? Yeah. So, I'm not scared of either of these Pokemon. And I think they're both still going to be around. I think both of my Pokemon are still going to be around at the end of this turn. And even if they're not, uh, Rabidash outspeeds these two. So Rabidash can come in and get the kill if I can't get up Trick Room for whatever reason. But I don't think that's even possible. They just haven't Dynamaxed yet. That's the biggest thing that... that they have on their side. We eat this snarl, thanks to the Koba Berry. Eat it up, num num num. In fact, uh, and no more trick room. Do I even need to? I think I'm gonna switch into Rabidash here and just go for a Trick Room. No, I can Nightshade into the Arcanine. I wanna get Psychic Terrain back up. I still think that Ndidi has some life in it. Especially if we can get up another Trick Room. So let's switch into Rabidash here. If I wasn't so ahead in this battle, then I wouldn't be making moves like this, I don't think. Uh, I'd probably just go for the safe thing there. And Oh, we caught that Heat Wave. Nice and good. I thought there was a chance they'd go for a fire move there uh, with Ndidi. Or into the uh, Ndidi slot. Be it Heat Wave or Flare Blitz. We can Nightshade into this Arcanine. Get that thing nice and low. Pop its Pinch Berry. Not great. Look at my little head popping up behind that Arcanine. Do you see what I'm... What is... That's so weird and funny. <laughs> okay. Oh, and look! Now I'm behind the rabbit edge. Okay. Um, yeah, so I could just... I'm in no rush 
to like attack that. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna double into Arcanine. We'll get rid of this thing. Arcanine protects, okay, fine. Pro prolonging the inevitable. If they go for like an earthquake, fine. Uh, it'll pop our weakness policy. Yep. Just don't crit me, please. Even if you do, we'd be fine. We'd be okay. Thank you. Weakness policy. Policy. Told you. Uh, okay. What is their last Pokemon? Do we know? We don't know yet. It could be a couple of things. I'm going to get big with Rabidash here. Uh, should I? No. No, I shouldn't be greedy. I could bounce with Rabidash here. That might be a pretty good move. If I bounce in Trick Room, that'd be sick. Would it? Or would that be dumb? I'm gonna. I don't even care. Yeah, I'm gonna. They protected. This is why I went for bounce, because now if I go for bounce here, I can dodge a move from the Arcanine and on the next turn dodge a move from the Arcanine. Because the Arcanine's slower. You see? Maybe it was a dumb play. Maybe it was a dumb play. Unnecessary, some would say. But let me flex my Rabidash bring. Um, and then maybe I just switch into Blastrier now. Because we just got the Trick Room up. And they're not going to go for a fire move. They shouldn't go for a fire move. Even if they do, I think I'd be fine. I have an Assault Vest. Right, they protected because they know that Bounce is coming. That makes sense. Meteor Mash is going to go into my uh, Glass Gear, but I should take that pretty, pretty good. Yeah. Cool beans. Um, and now Glass Gear can just uh, Dynamax and destroy a life or two. What do you think? Let's Flare Blitz into that slot, and let's get big here, and let's just go for a Max Quake. Let's not mess around any longer. We have the momentum. We have the Dynamax button, and we have a slow ice horse that can do us wonders. I hope you noticed, by the way, this entire video I've been wearing my horse shirt. There's one horse shirt in this game. And uh, I'm wearing it because this is the horse team. This is the horse team. Solid Max Quake action coming out into the Arcanine. They did not protect with their Metagross. So Rabidash, if it doesn't get Earthquaked to death. It's not going to matter. It's not going to matter. You know, my opponent's so far behind. Rabidash goes down. But it's okay. That's all right. Now we can bring a Diddy back out. Uh, Lando, you can, you can do whatever you want, buddy because you're not gonna be able to survive. We did know that it was Lando, by the way. I said that we didn't know who was back there. Was that this game? Maybe that was a different game. I'm going nuts, man. I'm going nuts. I think that was actually a different game that we saw the Lando. We have not seen, have we seen this Lando? Oh gosh, I cannot remember. I cannot remember. Expanding Force and Hailstorm. Uh, they still have not Dynamaxed. Do you think they'll realize they haven't Dynamaxed? Or will they continue on a streak of poor decisions? Starting with the closet this morning. I don't know. 
I don't know. All I know is I'm wearing a horse shirt and some slick yellow glasses. And my opponent is wearing tights. Like they just like they just got back from a gymnastics meet. It does look pretty cool in the zoom in. Are they wearing a Oh my gosh, wait, they have a tattoo on their arm. Did you see that? Is that part of the Is that part of the outfit? Part of the gymnastics thing? That's interesting and weird. Okay. Hailstorm's not gonna do it. Meteor Mash is gonna miss. It wouldn't have done it. I mean, you saw how much Meteor Mash did when um, last year wasn't even big. So with more HP, we're only gonna do more and more damage. We're only gonna take more and more da take less and less damage. Uh, and now we can just clean house. I'm, I'm surprised my opponent has stayed in it this long. To be quite honest. Max guard, not going to do it, unfortunately, for my opponent. But good try. Good try. Excelente. Excelente. Uh, yeah, sweet. And that'll be, uh, that'll be game three there. Three wins. Who'd have thunk it? Three wins, one for each horse. One for each horse on the team. You love to see it. Again, 50 likes on this video, and you too can use this team. Uh, for yourself, I will share another video in which I use the team. It might have a little bit of an update. At that point, who knows? Maybe I'll throw a Mudsdale on the freaking team. You know what I mean? Uh, but uh, it'll be the same concept. The three horses will definitely be on the team that you get if this video gets to 50 likes. You can be sure of that. Good game to my opponent. Hey, thanks so much for checking out this video. If you enjoyed this team and you want to use it for yourself, again, 50 likes is the like goal. I will share the rental code if this video gets to 50 likes. Uh, comment and subscribe to help others see the video. Uh, raise your chances of getting that rental code. Uh, and again, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Uh, I have membership starting soon to get um, some of the more avid uh, subscribers. Uh, some perks. Uh, that'll be pretty fun. I'm going to be streaming on Thursday nights weekly. Uh, so definitely check that out. Not sure what I'm going to be streaming. I'm going to be streaming Pokemon. Just not sure what kind of thing. Uh, uh, again, that'll be tomorrow night if you're watching this uh, on the day it premiered. Um, and uh, I also have just good ideas. I think good ideas for uh, different kinds of videos that I'm going to start making pretty soon. Uh, I have a pretty cool idea for a Nuzlocke if that's your thing. Might start doing that on stream. Might start doing that in videos. Might do a little bit of both. Uh, and uh, yeah, just some other cool concepts for the channel in general. Uh, and now that I have a setup, uh, you know, this is going to change if, you know, if there were weird technical things in this video, you can let me know, but also I'll probably see it in the edit and I'll want to change some stuff anyway. Uh, but thank you for your patience regarding that. And, uh, yeah, thanks for your patience. Uh, you know, I, I, I was gone for a little bit and, uh, it feels great to be back. So I appreciate the support in the time that I was gone and I appreciate the support now. Suppreciate. I almost just said I'm making up words here. Uh, Hey, horse team. Horses in the back, fire emblem, three horses. Until next time, my name is Berm. <laughs> See you later. Nanny nanny boo boo, stick your head in doo doo.